Hello friends, we now know a lot about lenses. Now let's go deeper and learn how to draw ray diagrams to show how lenses work. A lens has two sides, but when we draw the ray diagram, we consider lens as a single surface element as thickness of the lens is usually very small. So in ray diagrams, we don't show refraction at each surfaces separately. Instead, we bend the ray once after that it follows the path of the emerging ray means in ray diagram we show ray entering the lens and then emerging from it after bending. We don't need to show what happens inside the lens. Now how much the ray will bend depend on its path. For example, any ray passing along the principal axis doesn't deviate, that is it doesn't bend and any ray passing through optical center doesn't deviate. The rays traveling parallel to principal axis converges at the focus in case of convex lens and appear to diverge from the focus in case of concave lens. The light ray passing through the focus in case of convex lens or the light ray traveling in the direction of focal length in case of concave lens will take path parallel to principal axis after refraction. When parallel ray making angle with principal focus fall on lens, they would converge at a point on focal plane or appear to be diverging from a point on focal plane. The focal plane is a plane perpendicular to the principal axis of the focus. So most of the cases in real life is one of these cases of the light. So we should remember the behavior which is different in case of convex and concave lens. In our next lesson, we will explain how lens forms image using ray diagrams.